Waddell. Just the man I'm looking for. I'm right here doing this every day. Well, today, I have a divine purpose for you. What are you wearing? Is this come as your not day? I'm Evan Whitney. I work with a colorful group who are the most politically incorrect people you will ever meet. And that's why I created Colored People Incorporated. You didn't create colored people. We created colored people. Whatever, Jada. We can bring creative diversity solutions to your business or organization that's turned up when it comes to bigotry. Just stop. We are colored people. We don't have to talk about this name. Do you know how much money some of these black mega churches bring in? That guy, Bishop Johns, he drives a Bentley. Dude, and a private helicopter. Oh, is he the one in the November issue of Black Enterprise? Why are you reading Black Enterprise? Because it's Black Men Enterprise. For the articles. Jordan, he is married. To Jesus. Evan, what you know about Jesus? I know that Jesus doesn't have nothing to do with the money we're about to cha-ching. You know, I was reading something the other day where they said that the revenue we bring in from churches is completely tax-free. That's not true. No, I read it on the internet. Something about churches being tax-exempt. Actually, it was about these liberals who are trying to do away with religious tax exemptions. So, you know what? If we're gonna get on this, we're gonna have to do this. Yes? Soon. Yes, he's here. Evan, it's the IRS. They've already tried and convicted you of tax evasion. They're sending over a lifer to preemptively make you his bitch. Whatever action badge. Look, find a way to get out of us paying taxes or I will find another dreidel spinner to do it. How about I find a way to profit off the book you write? Fifty Shades of Orange. There's lots of anal in your story too, Anastasia. Jordan, this is an office. Anal? Jesus. Evan, she's calling you. Please, he's already got a god complex. You know, I once cooked the books for a very prominent family. They were in sanitation in New Jersey. Yeah, I know, but I was naive. That situation was all kinds of unfortunate. I could have easily been in that meat locker when the feds busted in. Thank God for that delay on the A train. <laughs> okay. So, Evan, what's your plan? And how exactly is Waddell involved? Well, Waddell is gonna pitch our idea. Your idea. Ah, Natalie's already got a proposal all written up. Mm. You told me to write a proposal for Daisy Rock Nation. And you told me it was about the, it's the black Illuminati. I was calling it the Numinati. That was yesterday, huh? Keep up. Now, I know that the black preachers probably aren't gonna trust me. It's one of the few times my skin color's a negative. Ah, fortunately for all of you, got a mind like a steel trap. Yesterday, you asked me what book Genesis is in the Bible. You see, what I need is for Waddell to be my, uh, what is it that you call it in the gangster rap songs? My, uh, trap star. I don't think that means what you think it means. Uh, my mule? Fluffer. Yeah, that's it. No, I mean, I know a mule is when you're all like, uh, uh, uh with the drugs, but what do you know? You know, I... I used to be a narc for the Cincinnati PD. You remember that big drug dealer they brought down in the 90s? Fellow by the name of God. Shame what they did to his own boy. Gave him the business end of a pool stick and then cut him up and left him in a dumpster. And I couldn't do a damn thing about it. I was in deep, too deep, some might say. That sounds a lot like that LL Cool J movie. Based on a true story, son. Now, Adele, I was thinking. This is not thinking, Evan. This is scheming. And we talked about it. You're no good at it. Yeah. Do you have a better idea? Let me give you a little lesson on black people. I know you think you're one of us because I taught you how to twerk the other day. <laughs> yeah. But black people are not stupid. We always recognize when our economic power is being taken advantage of. Now we might not be smart enough to do anything about it, but we still know when it's happening. Well. And don't get it twisted. Good, hard-working black folk. Turn to your neighbor and say, we are good, hard-working black folk. We, we are good, hard-working hard black, black folk. folk. Yes. Good, hard-working black folk are waking up and starting to demand that their hard-earned dollars be put right back into their own communities, just like the Jews. Come on.
on, everybody, get up. Turn to your neighbor and say, just like the Jews. Just, just like, like the Jews. Jews. And the Asians. George. And the Hispanics. Well, the legal ones. And Evan, you trying so hard to find a way to bank off the black church is only going to backfire. In fact, I am pretty sure that Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. and our other leaders didn't work so hard to earn the black church such powerful influence. So Evan Whitney circa 2014 could just come waltzing in with the harebrained idea and use them. Just like that fat broke security guard used Jordan for damn near three months. Amen. Gina. Sorry. You know, I marched alongside Martin. He was a great man. Had irritable bowel syndrome, just like me. We used to joke about who spent more time in the bathroom. <laughs> you know, IBS can be brought on by stress. And that man bore the weight of the world. I was there that day, you know, at that motel in Memphis. I told them that place gave me a bad vibe. Any motel that only carries one ply toilet paper is haunted by the devil. Hey, what's up? What's that? Hello? What up? It's for you. It's the tall tale police. You're under arrest! <laughs> Jesus, Edwin. That is so disrespectful. I can't. I can't. Oh with him. my god. Please excuse his rudeness, Waddell. what we talked about. Hello. You all are looking mighty fine today. You know, this reminds me of the time I helped Barry. You know, President Obama? Well, I helped him write that DNC speech that made him so famous. That kid, I tell you, he didn't know nothing from nothing till I came in. I just told him, just imagine them all naked. Just a room full of droopy titties and little dicks. <laughs> Something tells me this is not gonna work. <laughs> Man, it's a lot of bad, bad in the building. Amen. A couple real, real in the building. Amen. I'm finna kill in the building. Amen. I tell her way to fit the bottles and she tell me say win and I say church. We make it light up like a church.